All right, here is the week three choice board for the online AG3 class. Again, same format. Um, focus of the week is we're going to be completing the final targets from unit one. And the last two targets recognize the different algebraic forms of a quadratic function, including applications. That's the big one we're going to focus on today is real world applications. Um, so still your same kind of normal schedule. It's going to be due on Friday this week instead of Thursday because progress reports went out. Um, I didn't include any videos on this because it's the same targets from last week. So if you didn't go back through and watch those videos, I suggest that you do the same from our week two choice board. Um, same contact info and all of your links are right here. So the objectives are still the same, but it's a new vocab. Factor zeros, quadratic. That could be one of your options, or if you still have your notes, or if you explain what you remember about the target and you can either record a video or type it up. Um, here is your worksheet with the practice problems. Um, in fact, I know that we have done this already this semester, so if you still have this, this is gonna be a really easy um, completion for your activity. Um, there's also a real world application. Um, there's going to be an example here for you on what you could use these in a real world, like throwing a ball up in the air. Um, and then an example of a real world graph. Um, or through Desmos, um, again, I set up a, an activity on here. You just click that and you join the class code. It's already pre pre-populated there for you. So you just hit join and complete those 30 slides. Um, another teacher at Wyandotte created a how-to video, so I've linked that here for you. Got a Google form for your reflection or you record a video about um, real life parabolas. Um, and then you have your questions on right here. Mystery column is right here at the end. And then don't forget the exit slope down here.